Talk about Sabonis forcing the opponent to make some changes to their lineup to try and deal with his dominance inside. And we are underway. This crowd is already lit. A Friday night, first night of a back-to-back. -back. Maybe they, they have another season uh, of down basketball, but they've been one of the big surprises so far this season. Well, Josh Giddy has a lot to do with that. A sophomore, second year in the league. Get to their main spot, which is get into the paint. Look for spray three. See if you can't get to the free throw line when you're struggling to shoot the ball. A 9-0 OKC start, and it's OKC team. At scoring the basketball, challenging defenses. Last year, they finished 30th in the NBA, just under 104 points a game. This year, they're up to 7th as Keegan Murray getting a little bunny there at the rim. What about this pace so far, Katie? I mean, both these teams are in the top 10. Kings come in at six today. They're usually in the top five, and OKC is second. And you see right there, Shea getting to a sweet spot, a little mid-range jump. Fox getting down. Oh, throws it down. You can never speed that guy up. He's always on cruise control. Oh, nice time on the inside as Williams gets the bucket and the foul. Isaiah Joe checking in for OKC. Here's Shea Gilgis. Alexander doesn't take a lot of them, but he can knock them down. Keegan, straight away, got it. One of the most important things if you're switching off as a big, like Chemezi Metu in that situation, you can't go for the pump face. You gotta use your length and space. How about that? OKC goes into a zone. He makes it a one point game. King shooting 58% from the field. Man, just discards the Aaron Fox. They're gonna keep coming at you as Chemezi puts it on the deck. Fox. Slow rolling his way the glass is De'Aaron. Really improved their game. Isaiah Joe, for instance, yeah. is one of them. And Pukashevsi, another yeah. big that is injured right now and out. He's another one of their development guys. And there's Lou Dort, just the dagger in the Kings. How do you balance, Matt, really worrying about a team's three-point shooting as well as keeping them out of the paint? You just got to play defense. I mean, you, you got to know who the shooters are and run those guys off the line. And then you got to make sure your second line of defense is ready to cover for you. So 9.38 left to go. We'll check you out at halftime. Matt Morgan. We'll also hear from Matt in the third quarter. Thanks, Matt. They average 14 a game, one of the better teams at yeah. taking care of the ball. No, I mean, they certainly are in the top 10, and, and that is, a for a young team, a great thing. But here you go. We were just talking <laughs> about Trey Lyle. It's a two-point ball game, under eight to play here in the second. I mean, you've got multiple Thunder players as they get back to the rim with multiple threes right now. It's amazing what can happen when you focus in on something, a certain component of your game. Oh, Malk, little pocket pass. Malik serving out dimes like a bank teller. Kings down by six, 5.18 to go here in the second. Isaiah Joe, feeling it, knocks down his fourth three. You're, you're pretty pleased with yourself. Domas' his fourth rebound. Here he is, this time going to the spin cycle. Yes, sir. And that is a reminder, <laughs> an education. They're 16th in the NBA in three-point percentage, but so far, 55%. And that's an area of their game where they've really improved this year. There you see Kevin Herter getting that nice little floater on the baseline. Over some heavyweight competition, and you see the confidence of this team as Shea gets into the paint. Giddy, three ball, bang. That's 11 triples for Oklahoma City. Sacramento, we meanwhile just three. Herder looking for four. Got it. Herder, a hard screen on Dort. Fox, four on the clock. De'Aaron Fox, butter. Knew at some point it was going to start to self correct back in their favor. And Harrison Barnes, who's shooting the three so well out of the plate, knocks it down. Fox, harassing Giddy. Little stutter step drive spin for Gilgis Alexander. And he's heating up back to back buckets. He seems to be okay. He's up. That shot is up. And in. Harrison Barnes over to Sabonis. 
Herter had to backdoor cut instead. They go to Keegan. Oh, my God! Keegan Murray did it to him! In the Western Conference, he should garner some MVP votes. I, I know he won't get it, but... Joe shading down, so DeMontis gives it up, gets it back. Two-man game with Davion. Three ball back. This was a player, by the way, that was cut from the Philadelphia 76ers yeah. at the end of training camp. Picked up off of waivers. Whether it was a hard one or not, it, it was. was certainly yeah. sold, and it was a foul. Mm. Oh, Shea Gilgis. Fourth among Western Conference guards in the latest round of All-Star voting. Speaking of All-Star, that dude right there, De'Aaron Fox, should be in Salt Lake City next month. For the All-Star starters, 25% player voting and 25% media voting. And Shea, oh my gosh. That ain't right. Yeah. Come out of that zone defense finally. De'Aaron's gonna try and get himself into the paint. At the buzzer. Mr. Clutch delivers again. For everybody in attendance, if you're Sacramento looking to build on this lead three-point game, Barnes on the inside, HB got it. 95-88. Sacramento looking for their sixth straight win as Williams a little drop off to Giddy. A little too easy, right? Fast-paced game. Two of the top teams when it comes to pace in the NBA is Jalen Williams. Second chance opportunity as Malik. Rifles one on the inside. Malik. Monk shot clock down to five. Here's Fox for Fox. Little float game on point for De'Aaron Fox. And Mark Dagnall, he's going to take a timeout. Jay on the backdoor cut. As Harrison Barnes, great steal on the inside. Finding Domas at the free throw line. Murray looking for the triple. Bang, bang, bang. That's 100 career threes for Keegan Murray. Nice defense there. Domas nearly a rip. Isaiah Jones answers back. That's what you need around guys like he just Alexander, right? You need shooters that can be consistent and deadly. Keegan just hit one. Make it two. Keegan, 22 points to go along with a career high. Tough call, but you just got to play on Keegan. Oh, my God. Kenyon and here. Michelle, your son, is having himself a night. Shane trying to go one-on-one -on -one over De'Aaron Fox. And I tell you, oh, and he gives the two small. This was a guy that was cut from his JV team as a freshman. Now here he is doing work in the NBA. There's Harrison Barnes. Draws the foul on De'Aaron Fox, 14 foul. As Shea and the Kings fall asleep here on the inbounds pass. Herder on the pitch. Here's Keegan, two. Spin cycle, Keegan counted. Keegan Murray, he's got 27 to go along with 13 rebounds. And Sacramento on top by 10. As Harrison Barnes gets the rebound. Shea with the steal in transition. Don't want to foul here. Shea Gilchrist Alexandra. Where his boundaries are. Oh, they just uh, <laughs> They're not even taking Joe Ma's not happy about it. He said, nah, this game ain't over. Six-point game. 6.1 to go. Especially with the way this team is pressing. Yeah. Right now. And they're going to call out of bounds a turnover late. Herter looked Kevin like Herter. he got pushed. Isaiah Joe, three ball. Got it. A three-point game, 2.4 on the clock. Starting five on the floor for Sacramento. Harrison Barnes inbounds to Fox. Fox, and that should do it to Aaron Fox. How is he? <laughs> 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 